Yeah, so Graham, uh, could you just um, expand on your motivation for choosing the programme in the first place? Well, I've been in practice, clinical practice for 30 years and I've had an interest in the law and I was asked to do some expert witness cases for the Primary Care Trust and so that germinated my interest. So I started to look around and here I am. <laughs> Thank you so much. Um, so having successfully completed the programme, yes. what would, how would you sum up your overall experience? Oh, tremendous. Um, a great modern way to learn, um, great interaction with the other people, the postings, um, and it gave a, a lovely, solid, uh, sort of weekly basis to study, so you've always had some, a target to reach, which, which helps keep you on the ball for the whole thing and keeps it going. No, it was great fun, really enjoyed it. That's really. great. Um, so overall, it lived up to your expectations, you'd say? Oh yes, very much so, very much so. Uh, no downsides, really. No, really great. Great environment. Um, everybody involved, a great, great team. Yeah. Excellent. Well, this is why I love uh, doing these interviews, actually, you <laughs> get some good feedback. Oh, yeah, so, so. Um, so any aspects of the programme that you'd highlight in particular is, is working well for you? Oh, the, the weekly discipline, that really helped me focus, because you're working part of the time, you realise you've got to get things in by the Friday deadline if you want to get marked on it. So it's a, it's a, a very good incentive to, to study, definitely. Marvellous. <coughs> Um, so, what are your plans now, now that you are well, a successful project? <coughs> um, thrown sense to the winds, I've applied to a PhD, a medical legal PhD in King's College, uh, London, in um, risk control and um, consent in special needs patients. Okay. So there we are, well, <laughs> starting in April. Well, congratulations. <laughs> well, I really hope we can stay in touch. Oh, if of we're course. staying in this sort of yes, academic yes, environment, yes, yes. continuing to work in the field, it would yeah. be marvellous to yeah. sort of create links. Indeed, indeed. We have a great PhD community in medical yes. law in the school. Yes. So it's obviously not local for you. But yes. You know, those links. Yes, I would happily do it here. Nothing wrong with Edinburgh. But, but uh, it's just yes. the, the distance I have to be more. more Locally so, based. Okay, my sixth question yeah. I will adapt um, and <laughs> ask you um, how the experience of the LLM perhaps inspired you to consider even further study. Oh, uh, being worked for in practice for 30 years, you're not using your brain in an academic way, it's sort of day to day routine, and I found the, the boost of using my few remaining brain cells great, great, great incentive to do more. I, I missed it, I, mi I missed studying, so. There we are. That's it. Simple as that. So I can't, can't wait to do more. It sounds awful, but but. No, <laughs> yeah. That's marvelous. But you're going to continue in practice as well. Yes, for for the time being. Yes, for the time being. Uh, we'll see how we go. But part time.